Mauricio Pochettino received some encouraging news on the injury front with Armando Broja nearing a return. The young striker has successfully completed his rehabilitation after a nearly 10-month-long absence due to an ACL injury he sustained in a mid-season friendly against Aston Villa last season. Broja has resumed training at Cobham and could potentially rejoin the squad in the upcoming weekend. The Albanian Football Association president has expressed confidence that Broja will be available for Chelsea's Premier League clash against Bournemouth this Sunday, stating, Armando Broja has completed the recovery phase, and we expect him to be on Chelsea's bench this week, ready to make his comeback. As for Lavia, the Belgian midfielder has yet to make his debut for Chelsea. Pochettino is keen on ensuring he reaches the required fitness levels before involving him in matches. Unfortunately, Lavia suffered a muscle tear in his ankle during the international break, which may further delay his debut. It's anticipated that this ankle injury will keep him sidelined for at least a month, possibly extending to six weeks, meaning his potential debut might not occur until at least October. Good news is on the horizon for Badiashile, who missed the start of the season due to a hamstring injury sustained at the end of the 2022-23 season. Chelsea anticipates his return to fitness for their Premier League match against Bournemouth following the international break. A video posted by the club's official social media account showcased Badiashile back in training action, hinting at his imminent return later in the week. Reese James is continuing his recovery from a hamstring injury he suffered during training. He provided an update to supporters on his Instagram, assuring them that he'll be back soon. James was also spotted at Stamford Bridge during the Luton match, alongside Todd Bowley, John Terry, and Lavia. There's growing optimism that the right back will return after the September international break as he shared a picture of himself in training gear with the caption, Back to it soon. Carney Chakwamika, the lone goal scorer in a 3-1 loss to West Ham, unfortunately, sustained a serious knee injury just before halftime and left the London Stadium on crutches. Chakwamika is expected to be sidelined for approximately six weeks possibly missing only five or six games due to the international breaks before making a swift return. Christopher Nkunku's situation is less favorable. He was forced off during Chelsea's friendly against Dortmund due to apparent knee discomfort and is believed to have suffered meniscus damage to his left knee in Chicago. Consequently, he could be out of action for up to three and a half months with a potential return towards the end of 2023. Many see Nkunku's return as a crucial solution to Chelsea's early season scoring woes.